know, summertime fishing is my absolute favorite time of year to fish. I love fishing offshore. Today we're going to be concentrating on offshore river channel ledges, rocky high spots, and I'm going to target the irregularities in those areas. And the, I'm throwing the Bomber Fat Free 7. It dives down quick. It's got a little nice hard wobble to it, and I can really crawl it over the rocks and boulders down there. There he is. That's a good fish. So this time of year, the bait fish are all using these high spots and the bass are using them as ambush points to get the shad when they come in contact with the structure. Oh yeah, that's a good fish. This is what I'm talking about, these summertime, summertime offshore spots. That's the kind of fish you're catching on these things because they're all feeding on shad and it's summertime shad so we got a little better size quality in the bait fish and the bass are ambushing them on top of the rock pile so what happens is the suspending shad if they're suspending at 11 feet we're concentrating at rock piles and high spots in 11 feet and basically the shad are going to tell you this time of year how deep you need to be fishing so what I'm doing now see I got the crankbait down to depth and I'm banging into the structure down there and then when I hit the hard stuff the higher stuff I'll pull it with my rod and give it a little bit of a pause and sometimes that'll trigger the strike there he is I got him that's exactly what I said earlier you find how deep the shad are and then you know how deep you need to be fishing on this structure concentrate in the summertime on main river channel ledges and high spots that come up to the same depth as the shad and that's how you become successful at summertime cranking whoa these fish are just killing it look at that holy smokes that summertime fishing at its best man do i love this i love it and i live for it Offshore summertime structure fishing, fat-free shad. Look at that. That's a beauty.